I don't know who needs to hear this, but your worth exists at this very moment. Nowadays, the world has convinced us that our worth lies in the future. If you will do certain things, then you're going to be worthy of having the life of your dreams. You will be worthy as a person. And me, myself, have been there on this journey, having the same mindset that, oh, I'm not enough. I have to do this. I have to do this. I have to make this happen. Then only I will be worthy enough. My work is what considered my worth. It's not true. <laughs> when we go into the self-improvement journey, that's what everyone else is telling you. At least that's what you are telling yourself. That's the idea in itself that, oh, well, you're not good enough. You have to be good enough. And I buy that because, see, my whole content, my whole profession is about that. And I talk about it a lot. And I'm going to continue to talk about it. But I wanted to start this new year by saying that you already are enough right at this very moment. This is something which I don't used to understand until this very moment because today i just had this realization i was like no man i have to record i can't write it down i can't schedule it for some other day i have to record it right now if you want to accept this version of yourself if you don't feel worthy right now and if you hate this version of yourself because i know a lot of you do and you have this idea of, no man i have to change and there are few people out there who are telling you to do certain things and which is great you should do them but at the same time they somehow are making you feel a little less feel like you're not worthy enough i don't buy that idea and the reason for that is because intention matters if you're working out because you hate your body there's a difference and if you're working out because your body have done so much for you and you have always took it for granted but now you want to improve then there's a huge difference it's all really about intentions if you feel like oh well you haven't been prioritizing yourself enough and now you want to do it now you want to improve yourself in certain things rather than seeing yourself as a project seeing yourself as a machine that oh well no i have to you know it's coming from someone who is constantly on her a game it's actually very sad that this was the feeling that was constantly driving me like i have to be better than anyone else uh you have to be constantly on your a game or you can just relax and because i wasn't feeling worthy and um so if the people i was watching was like no i have to be good enough like i have to be like them i have to be sort of good enough i'm not good enough yet you're gonna grow at your own pace and yes you need to do the work and yes it's important to do the work so that you don't hurt yourself and others but i don't want you to step into this journey by having this mindset that oh i hate myself i have to improve no you are enough you're a divine being you're a soul on a journey you're a multi-dimensional being and the whole universe is within you your higher self your spirit guides are always there to support you you are not alone. Mama guy is there and most of the time we forget. But this is your reminder. Take back the power. You are enough. You are already enough. Yes, maybe there are certain parts of you which you don't like and you would definitely love to work on them. But it doesn't mean that you deny what you are right now. And uh, you sort of see less of yourself. Don't do that. You are so much more capable and powerful than you think that you are. You are so much more than you think that you are thank you so much for watching this video if this message resonated with you and if you think that somebody needs to hear it do share it if you're someone who has spent most of their lives seeing less of themselves then no it's time to take the power back we are not doing the same shit this year we're taking back the control we're stepping into a power lots of love and power to you with that i'll see you in the next one